As Lobos, we will lead by example, encourage positive relationships, achieve our full potential, and develop habits and skills. Lobos, lead the pack. Ah, woo! Good morning, Lobos. Today is Wednesday, November 6th, and it is a blue day. Oh, I'm so sorry. Yeah, you're good. Uh, <laughs> I'm doing a sprinkler inspection. Yeah, you're good. Uh, one concealed. Okay. Oh, uh, we just had the sprinkler inspection. Um, like I was saying, it is a blue day, and we have a few announcements to help you get through the day. The weather today is. Mr. Gote. Currently 75 degrees Fahrenheit. It is partly cloudy today. The low is 63 degrees Fahrenheit. Tomorrow we will have light rain showers. 68 degrees for the low and 75 for the high in Fahrenheit. We also have two birthdays to celebrate today. One, we have Mariana, who's turning 11, and Emily, who's turning 12. Happy birthday to you. There are a few announcements from around campus. Students, Pasadena High School will, will be having their annual Burn Sam Carnival and Festival tomorrow, November 7th. If you go to the Burn Sam, it is going to be tomorrow. It's going to be at Pasadena High School. You can bring anyone in your community, your parents, your anyone, anyone, your bro your brothers, your annoying sisters, anyone. You There will be games. There will be a dunk tank face painting, karaoke, obstacle co courses, a photo booth, and there will also be food and drinks. The admission will, at the gate will be $3, $2 pre-sale from any BPA member or from the Eagle's Nest. The time will be in the carnival will start at 4.30 p.m. to 7 p.m. The pep rally starts at 7 p.m. Make sure so if you don't know what they're going to do here at the pep rally, they're basically just going to get a giant pole. They're going to tie some giant clothes stuffed with hay, and then they're going to light them on fire with a big torch. And it's going to be really cool. Yeah, they're, they're playing Sam Rayburn High School. So yeah, that's their competition. It's their, their uh, it's a rivalry. Yeah, so so Yosemite Sam is San Rayburn's mascot. Like we have Lorenzo the Lobo. They have uh well they're the Texans, but they they Yosemite Sam is their mascot and that's what they're going to do on Friday is they're going to burn an image of Yosemite Sam um as a way of getting people hyped up for Passing high school beating Sam Rayburn. So there you go. Mr. Grote shy. Students, days of all dance incentives start this week. Remember, if you have no office referrals and only one lunch detention, you can attend days of all dance. There will be a real DJ there, so make sure you practice your dance moves. Students, your your language arts teacher should have given you a reading tracker for the 40 book challenge. Here are some incentives you earn by staying on track. Make sure you take your eight art test on on each book because that's how they keep track. If you re November 1st, we can you can check off your list that was last Friday. December in December 2nd, you will get a snack if you read 10 books. 15 by January 8th, you'll get a popcorn party. 20 by February 5th, stack picnic. 30 by April 1st, ice cream party. Why do I not believe that? 40 by April by May 15th, sorry, you will get a stack pick and a pizza party. And now it's time for our sign language lesson of the day. We have some visitors that will do a lesson Introducing to say to say I am 
I am Genesis Solano. I'm Octavius Akers. I'm Ezekiel Palomo. I got some bad cut here. And what will y'all be demonstrating for us today? The letter of the day today will be an A, so it will be a sign like this. So, can you sign that for me, please? The letter A. And then the word of the day. And then the word of the day will okay. be thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Excellent. Thank you for this presentation. Excellent job to our student to our visiting students here. Shout out to Miss Munoz for having this all possible, everybody. So if you see her, make sure you give her a thank you and a hug if you want to. Okay, but now students, make sure you are bringing your cans to your homeroom teachers. There are exciting prize, prizes for bringing cans. That is the time we. That is the time of year we bring in our can do food drive. The boxes here are. Uh, the boxes are here. Our alpha team has been making posters and determining what our rewards will be every week. If students bring five cans this week. Oh yes, tomorrow is the last day to bring cans. Sadly, I wish we had more time, but. It doesn't matter because our Lobos will win again. Mr. M, we're coming for you. Anyways, determining what our reward, our alpha team has been making posters and determining what our rewards will be every week. Like I said, tomorrow's the last day. If students bring five cans by tomorrow, we will have started collecting cans today. This week's, this week's reward will be Pajamas, you can wear your pajamas to school and Tech Friday. Uh, Mr. M, like I said, Mr. M, we're coming for you, has also agreed to be silly string if we win again this year. First year we collected 2,042 pounds. Last year we collected over 4,500 pounds. What can our Lobos achieve this year? Students, make sure you recycle your used markers in the box in front of the office so they can be recycled. And now it's time for the cheesy joke of the day brought to you by In The News. Why did the turkey cross the road? I don't know. Why? Because it was Thanksgiving Day and he, saw, and he wanted people to think he was a turkey. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. This has been In The News and Las Noticias. Have a wonderful Wednesday, Lobos.